Alrighty, just got back from Wonderland and I have some exciting news as you're seeing on the screen There are markings that are appearing in a completely different area from the potential Harmony Hall That's gonna be built on Vortex Hill This is a Whitewater Canyon and Action Theater area and there are survey markings all over the place and we definitely didn't find them all we, we could have spent all day looking because these things are hidden um, really well and uh, in fact so well that we didn't notice them on day one we found them on day two but here are markings they have even numbers on them which is a really good sign now uh, we can't say for sure, obviously no one can ever say for sure that this could mean coaster or that these could be column numbers. Um, they could be survey marking numbers, like where a survey company has to come in. But it is a really good potential sign that Canada's Wonderland is due for something exponentially large like a roller coaster sometime in 2023 so using the math that cedar fair usually does in terms of construction for a new roller coaster i would expect that seeing signs like this pop up could mean that we got are getting a coaster in 2023 and to be honest that 100 percent makes sense to me because of what's gone on at canada's wonderland if anyone remembers when the pandemic first hit canada's wonder or sorry cedar fair said that they were going to operate similar to how canada's wonderland did coming out of SARS. And we know that Canada's Wonderland needed a roller coaster coming out of that pandemic to draw people back in. And based off of what we're seeing on social media and the reservation system, it hasn't necessarily gone as busy or as a rush of people coming back to the park as I would have expected. I do expect that to autocorrect itself, and maybe they don't necessarily need a roller coaster, but Cedar Fair could be looking to put another wow bomb of a coaster at the park to draw people back in. But as you can see, there are survey markings literally literally littering um, Whitewater Canyon, the Action Theater area, and the path going up to Flying Canoes. So definitely a lot of really good signs as it spans a large plot of land, and a plot of land that a building wouldn't go. So that's a key emphasis. A building would not not span that large of an area um, and would not take up an entire pathway as it um, is shown. So super exciting news. And one of the main things I think are this could end up being is a mock double launch or a wing coaster. And I'm going to show you guys one of our creations made by Ryan Roller Coaster on YouTube. Go check him out. He has crazy planet coaster creations um, of Canada's Wonderland. But here it is, a wing coaster for Canada's Wonderland. Thanks for watching the update. Have a good one. Bye. <laughs>